Welcome to Richard Banker Web Design Tutorials. Today we are looking at Widget Kit Gallery. And uh, Widget Kit is a neat little tool that you can use to create galleries, slideshows, and things like that. And so we're going to take a look at it. Here you can see that we have this image wall that we've created. It's got six images in it. And I'm going to show you how to add some images to it, how to move those images around. And we're just going to take a couple minutes here to look at that. Widget Kit Gallery put out by Utheme is a commercial extension so you have to pay for it. You can see here the different examples. They have a showcase box, image wall example, Polaroid example, uh, slider example which is pretty cool, second slider example, showcase screen example, the default example, another showcase example, so there's all these different ways that you can change your gallery up. You can see here we just have six images, uh, rounded corners. Now to get to this, we go to Components. We go down to Widget Kit. Uh, this is assuming that you have a gallery already set up. Otherwise, you would just hit the Add New button. And here we have the gallery called Test. Now within the gallery, you can see we have our six images here and on the side we have all of our different settings. So here you can choose some of those examples that we looked at before and these are the different options you have to configure them. Now let's say that we wanted to add some new images. I have a picture of a cowboy here that I would like and by simply dragging and dropping it in there it adds it and let's add two more just to make nine images. So now when I hit save and then return to my front page and refresh you can see that we have all of these six images or all these nine images here now instead of just the six that we previously had. Now what most often happens is that we have say we want to have the default one which is more like a slideshow and I'm going to hit save. You can see that after we do that all of our options change. Now I'm just going to leave it as default the way it is just for saving time. Now when we refresh on the front side we now have it as a, a slideshow. Now, usually your slideshow is more like this Joomla logo where it'll be big and across the screen. Mm -hmm. This is just the way I've got the images set. It really doesn't matter. Now, the one thing that you may want to do is you see you have this gentleman here, but you really want this picture of the cowboys to be first. There's no way to change the order of the gallery, unfortunately. Now if you're using a small amount of images and you want to change it, a quick and easy way to do that, as you can see, two cowboys by fire. I'm going to delete that one. I'm going to go into my file here. I'm going to make that one and I'm going to make this one two. And re-upload those two files. The order by default over here is in uh, numerical, alphabetical order. So first numerical and then alphabetical. Uh, you can see we still had this other file that I had previously named with a one, so I'm just going to delete that. So by default, it's going to go one, two, three, four, five, five, you know, working its way down. And so by naming this one and this one two, it works. It's uh, you're able to control which one is showing up first. So now when we hit save and refresh 
we have the cowboy image first. It's not really the best way to do it, but that is a easy way to do it without using other extensions. Now, if you have, if you're planning on having a whole ton of images in here, say 50 or more, you may not want to use one. You'll probably want to use start with 11, 21, 31, and so on, or maybe even starting in the hundreds or a long numerical string. That way, as you add images and you want them to be in a specific order, you can just simply insert them. If you're not really concerned about the order, you can always choose random over here, and it will just randomize them every time the page is refreshed. That's a quick look at the Widget Kit Gallery by Utheme. If you need help setting, up, setting it up, stop by our website at richardbankerwebdesign.com. Fill out a ticket, we'd be glad to help you out. Or click on the link below in the description. Thanks for stopping in and watching. Have a great day.